When firefighters battled two house fires in College Point yesterday, they did not use fire hydrants. That's because there aren't any. And today, some residents are asking why. As News 13's Courtney Evans tells us, Bay County officials say it's not so easy to install fire hydrants without people paying for them. Lightning strikes ignited fires at two houses in College Point Tuesday, destroying both. Fire also destroyed a third home in the same area back in November. In each case, bystanders wondered why firefighters did not have access to any nearby fire hydrants. Bay County doesn't have water and sewer uh, utility services in the College Point area. Our uh, uh, utilities lines end uh, just before you get out into that area. So the folks who live out there actually are on uh, septic and well services. And so uh, we, don't, we don't offer water and sewer lines. And without water lines, you don't have fire hydrants. College Point is in an unincorporated area. You uh, have a different level of service. Um, you also pay a different uh, level of taxes and, and so uh, folks who live inside the city limits of the municipality are, are uh, going to be paying you know fire taxes. The same issue arose in 2010. And so we examined the possibility of an assessment on the properties out there and basically that means that um, the folks who live in that area would fund the extension of the utilities out there. At the time, the cost would have been a little more than $6 million. About $25,000 per uh, property owner back then. So uh, it was considered uh, by the property owners at that time. We had a couple of public meetings uh, back then uh, and they opted not to, to pursue that. County utilities workers were back in the area Wednesday. We're, we're looking at um, what would be required to extend those lines out there. Maybe there is an opportunity to, to secure um, some funding. We, we want to work with the community there and, and do what we can to, to help them. In Bay County, Courtney Evans, News 13, Panhandle Strong. While hydrants are crucial for firefighters to do their jobs, they say yesterday's fires still would have destroyed those houses because they started up in the attics.